Hello and welcome on the journey, Pisces. Pisces, on my way home, I heard, I ain't worried. And you know that One Republic song? So right now I feel a lot of you are feeling like life is good. You are living with no regrets and some of you might feel like time is running out, but what is it running out on? So let's find out. What, is the, what do the angels say? Ooh, flying right out onto the lyric there. Patience. So you just need to have patience. Trust the higher forces of life to know what is best for you and remember that when you are asked to wait, you are being prepared for something even better than you expected. So change your attitude to one of acceptance, relax and take stock. Ask your angels to enfold you during this waiting period so that you can listen to the promptings of the divine. Do not rush off some wild goose chase of your lower will. When the time is right and you are ready and refreshed, the next door will open. Patience is always rewarded. So here's an affirmation. All things happen at the perfect time. So isn't that interesting? That you may not be worried, but you feel as if time is running out at the same time. <laughs> no pun on the time there. All right, let's look more into this, shall we? Looking at the cards, I feel that a lot of you, you want to take a chance on something. You're being guided to risk something and to follow, follow your heart on something new. Maybe you're leaving behind something that was comfortable and familiar, but it's no longer appropriate for you. And you're just going to be letting the new in and more meaningful opportunities to come along. Don't first, don't settle for less, Pisces, because you are, you're worthy of the best. So don't give up on yourself. Know that you are protected. You're being watched over. Yeah, and of course the first card out we have <clears throat> strength and I'm getting all choked up. So a lot of you I feel that have been feeling incompetent in some way or you've allowed people all your life to make you feel like you were inferior or unworthy, but you are. So it's time to take back your courage here. You might have been dealing with a Leo. So this is about being open to success, to know that you're a winner. Don't be shy and don't also be afraid to say no. We have the three of swords, so I can see why you are not here. You need to say no for some of you because you've been and this skeleton is stabbing this person in the back. You feel like you've been stabbed in the back here. This has been really painful. Somebody has broken your heart and you are going through this need to heal yourself, to forgive yourself and others because maybe there was some kind of misunderstanding or miscommunication in a situation. Tell me about this situation. Ten of Wands, yeah. <laughs> the Ace of Swords, yeah, and the Knight of Wands. Somebody was playing. Somebody was playing. And you felt burdened. You knew. Something about the situation tells me that you, you have so, you've been working so hard that you didn't notice. And now you can see the truth. There's something you learned. But it's also the fact that you're gaining clarity because you've been so busy that it's time for you to get started on something that you want to do. You have lots to do, so maybe it's time to make a plan. What are you going to do? Be fearless. 
you can get through this challenge right now. We have the Four of Swords and the Ace of Cups. So you have been so busy, you're being advised to take a rest here. Let it go. Let it go. I feel like you've been overanalyzing the situation and you've been really thinking about what to do next. So don't forget to meditate, to take a rest, to even though you've got a lot of work to do, you're feeling overburdened here, that are you gonna be able to make ends meet for some of you? You are, and you have the Ace of Cups. So just know that there is somebody new around you, maybe that you have been developing a relationship with, or there's just do things that you love to make yourself happy right now to take that time for yourself. All right, let's look at a mindset. What does Pisces need to hear to help them, their mindset? My life is supposed to be fun, so don't forget. Don't be worried because life is supposed to be fun. And if you're taking it too seriously right now, or you've been taking on the burdens of others and the pain of others, it's time to let that go. So be easy with yourself. Return to your state of self-appreciation. Feel love for your life, for the people of your world, and most of all, for yourself. There is great love here for you. And let's get a message of healing for Pisces. Message of healing. Fresh air. Get some fresh air, Pisces. Just take a little break. Dear Archangel Raphael, thank you for helping me breathe easier in all ways. So just get outside. If you have a, an animal, go take them for a walk because your animals, your pets are speaking to you. There's a cat here and there's a dog. And so maybe you need to get a, an animal to get you outside a little bit more. Power of attraction. So something there, trust the process here. Follow what you want instead of what you don't want and joy will burn out the pain. There's magic in this moment, but you might be impatient because you're, you're in healing right now. That's what I feel as you're going through some kind of expansion. So ask, believe, and receive, and also act on what you want here. And maybe it might mean a new job or a project. 10th house, the world, so there is success. You might be acquiring land, buying land, or really expanding in your career. There could be fame here for some of you. So if you've been feeling in a rut, don't worry. Be patient. There's Be methodical because you are successful. This is the 10th house of career and finances. So you will have, you will have what you need, but you have to believe that you can have that you can that you can expand your business let's get you a blessing a blessing for those who are nearing their final breath Ooh, cryptic wow so for some of you and maybe it's there's 43 so april 3rd Maybe something significant about that day that happened for you. So maybe for also, like you may feel like time is running out for some of you. I don't know. Well, if you are grieving something and the loss of somebody or somebody around you is going through something pretty major, don't be worried. Their transition 
will be will be safe they are protected they're being watched over and you will be protected physically emotionally and energetically okay spirit let's get a quote the more you are focused on time past and future the more you miss the now the most precious thing there is and isn't that interesting it fits with the message all right and one more one more card okay what do we have spirit what must come out to tell pisces remember who you are you are a powerful, loving, and creative child of God. You are very loved. And yes, you are, Pisces. Sending you a kiss and some love for this glorious future, knowing that you are a yes person, but you can also know when to say no, too, and not to take on too much right now, because your life is supposed to be fun. And I just saw 11-11. Be patient. Bye.